So why are we here? This broke. It twisted the throttle assembly. Clear down here, you can see the scarring, which bent the throttle cable. Also broke the lid to this. Like they say, it's always an adventure with me. You never know what the hell we'll be doing. But you can safely plan, it's not what we had planned. Romaniac Johnny! <laughs> First obstacle of the day with Mr. Johnny Mac, who just registered for Roll Maniacs. Cause he's a maniac. Somehow this clutch slid over. So I have to use two fingers right now and it's messing me up. It's on there. Yeah. Adapt and overcome, my friend. Adapt and overcome. Come on, Cody. This is not how you get up the Punisher. So it begins. Yeehaw! Today's not the day, dude. <laughs> Make that look too easy. It's a little teeny rock. It's a little teeny ass stupid rock. Might as well just Yeehaw! Yeehaw! go home now. You make that look so controlled and easy. Is your buddy? Probably. Yep. Cool. Hi, I'm Devin. Cody, nice to meet you, man. Well, Johnny catches up with Devin, let me explain what this video is and is not. This video in particular is a lot of failures. I ended up having to leave my bike up at the top of where I have got to because of some mechanical issues and some mental issues. So keep in mind, this is not a how-to video and it's not a show-off video. This is just my journey as a newer rider trying to learn some really hard techniques and the cool people that I'm meeting that help along the way. So it was nice meeting you, Devin. If you see this, take care. Hopefully uh, I'll be joining you guys in the future. <laughs> To be fair to myself, this obstacle Johnny just hit there, I usually go around it because it always gives me help. Hey, hey, that's the first time I've ever cleared that. Actually, ever. Johnny's been trying to teach me to look ahead, plan ahead, find where you're going to bail out, put your feet, etc. before you even attempt the obstacle. Very bad words. Ah, ha, ha. Woo! Yeah. You just gave up the gas? I'm not sure what I did. I felt my hand let go of the clutch in it. But, not bad. Let's do it again. Cool. All right, here we go, baby. I got it, I got it, I got it. Thank you. I've got a question for myself and the viewers, Johnny. So if you look at the trail, this is what my head sees, okay? So the trail goes, whew. every time I do that, it's not very great. So what do you see in your head when you do this? I look where I wanna originally go, which is right here. And right when I get there, I look at where I wanna go next. It's like a corner. So are you even looking at this at all, really? You're just aiming for a spot there. And then once you're up, deal with it. But I'll probably end up going right over there. Uh, 
mission successful. I committed and then I aborted mission. Better for you to kiss the handlebars and slide backwards right now than to wheelie out because I can grab the front when you do that. So kiss the handlebar. Okay. Just just hang on and go for the whole ride, huh? Yeah. I'm getting three quarters away and I'm kicking it out. But I made it. You had that one, then you gave it more gas. Oh yeah, baby! Right off the gas yeah. at the top instead of giving it all the gas at the top. That may be one of the better times I've done. It's amazing how much just a quarter of an inch of a lever can mess with you. Didn't mean to grab that. Oh. Oh. I'm sorry. Man, nothing like a clutch jump to the head when you're already bringing it down. Why did that? I didn't mean to. Hang on, I had you. Sorry. You gotta bring that front end down. But you're up. I mean, you did good. You just, when you start wheeling, let go of the gas. Pull that clutch in. I'm not hurt. So we're good. I thought you were bringing it down. I was going to pull that front end down and you'd have been good. All you had to do is hang on. I thought I had it. Next thing I know, I'm... Well, you're bailing. you got enough bail. Stay on that bad boy. I'm really sorry. I did not mean to throw the bike. <laughs> yeah, you were bringing it down. I was like, oh, I'll grab this. I thought I had it. You did. And then you dropped the clutch. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm good. I thought you had it. Break I really it. thought I was up. Maybe that's why I let go of it. You were up, and then you dropped the clutch. So you were coming down right here, and it was coming down, and I went to grab it, and then you jumped off the back I and dropped the clutch. I thinking I made it. So John went down to get tools to fix my stupid bike. I would not be surprised if he just left my ass here. I wouldn't blame him. I mean, obviously it wasn't intentional, but does that matter? The look on his face, like, why would you be such an idiot, look? Totally justified. I was saying that I just wanted to leave my bike here, walk out, never ride again. And then I got a message from my daughter who took her pharmacy technician's test today and passed. I'm so proud of her. And hopefully John is okay. That was very scary. Scary. I'm very sorry. I'm very proud of my daughter. Good job, Abby. I love you. What's up everyone? Cody with Dirt Nap Dirt Bike Adventures channel here. We are going on an adventure. A rescue mission. As John took me up the Punisher yesterday, I was going to make it all the way to the top. That was the plan. Man, it was a rough day. But uh, long story short, throttle cable broke. Had to push slash ride down the Punisher as much as I could with no throttle, no engine. And uh, I'm going to see if I can remedy that up on the mountain and hopefully my bike is still there because it spent the night last night. Not a good day yesterday. Did not make the Punisher. Broke the bike. Apparently threw it at Johnny Mac. Did not mean to do that. Weird thing is I hardly remember any of that. I remember getting to the top thinking, oh, I made it, but my wheel was way up in the air. And next thing I remember, Johnny Mac was under my bike going, what the hell did you do that for, dumbass? Anyway, should be a simple rescue mission for any normal human being, but you're watching the Dirt Bike Adventures channel, so guarantee this will be <laughs> one for the books hope you enjoy my misery hopefully it's a good video and turns out okay well, we're doing some uh, little bit of off-roading shall we say trying to find the best place to get the truck closest to the bike let's have some fun shall we you haven't lived until you have a truck and a trailer and you go through rocky whoops they're challenging on a motorcycle this is living like an idiot, probably. Mm -hmm. 
So here's a site that I uh, hope we'll never see again. Really? This is the start of the Punisher, and that's the 701 Chippewa, baby. Obviously, somebody's been up here today, because there's a picture of my baby bike on Facebook. so close to the end I had no idea how close I was there's my baby told you I'd be back just glad you're here baby okay people so it is 8 15 at night I am still trying to retrieve my bike we're getting into some right now but this is the way Johnny Mac confirmed via stupid satellite that doesn't work Unless I share it every two seconds and I can't be talking to him and share it. That's awesome. Anyway, this has become quite the damn adventure, people. But this is the way. Yep, I'm going to get Serenity. Look what I just rolled up on, people. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, I'm going to go get Serenity and bring her home. 